Greetings beloveds, let's take a look at a stock here that has had a nice performance. It is up nicely today, in fact for the day it is up about 40% plus. So let's take a look at how we could have owned this stock before, and I mean before today's explosive move, where we can see in the US markets it's the third most percentage, biggest percentage gainer for the day. So we'll take a look at that in this video, how we could have owned the stock before today's move. But first, I greet you in the love light of the one infinite creator. So I've been doing breakouts for 22 years plus for paid clients full time. 22 years of breakout experience every day. The last 22 years, every day the market is open. So there's a lot of experience here. So let's take a look at this stock here. We can see that this is the monthly chart stock IPO'd this year in March at about 35, under 35, now trading at 115. Now you can see from this monthly chart, the stock has only been trading for a couple months. So there's no monthly data. There's no RSI, there's no MACD. So definitely we can't use the monthly chart. So we have to go to the weekly chart. Let's take a look at the weekly and you can see the weekly. Yes, recently, once we had enough data, we started printing the MACDs and the RSI. But our entry, or when I sent out a breakout alert for my paid clients was all the way back here in May during this week right here when there was this breakout. So that was at about the beginning of May 2024. And again, you can see as of May 2024, we did not have enough data to print the RSI. So again, no enough data here to print the indicators that we use for breakout. So we have to go to the daily chart. And you can see here from my paid website, this is May 9th of 2024. And the stock is highlighted right here as an IPO breakout right here. So the breakout level was at 49.32. The stock was sent out when it was trading under the breakout of 49.32. So let's go back to that daily chart. And you can see on the daily as of the beginning part of May. So we're talking about this period here, right there. We have fully developed daily RSI, fully developed MACDs. So we could have used that and that is what I was using when I sent out that breakout alert. It was based on the daily because we did not have fully developed monthly and weekly charts. So the breakout level was under just under 50 somewhere here and my breakout alert was sent right there during that pullback day right there. Now you can see that the stock did have a nice run after that but subsequently there was a pullback to test the breakout again right here. So there's an entry here and I'm sure institutions who are buying this breakout were also using this retest as a re-entry. So that's where we got in. Again, we are using the minimum requirements for the ultimate Moade breakout. And you can see here when the breakout was sent out, the stock met the minimum requirements because you have your RSI moving to new highs here. You have your MACD trading at new highs also. So that meets the minimum requirements for the ultimate Moade breakout a method that I developed almost 20 years ago. Now, if you missed that breakout, there's another breakout here recently. So all is not lost. Take a look at the weekly chart and let's go to a one year daily. So let's say you missed the initial breakout. So let's say you missed this breakout here, which is where was our entry. But let's say you missed that. There's another breakout presented by the market recently here. Again, same minimum requirements. There's a breakout here. All right. That took place and you can see that with now fully developed MACDs and RSI, you can see that at that particular moment, let's go back and show the price breakout so we can have this clearly. So let's take a look at that high. So we can, that high right there, you can see a breakout here or here. You can see that at that time period, your RSI is moving above RSI 69.1 and that is October time period. And you can see at that time, the MACDs are also moving to three year highs, in this case, all time highs. So that meets the minimum requirements in terms of the RSI and the MACD. And again, because we don't have fully developed monthly charts, you could have used the weekly chart. So again, before today's explosive move, there were a couple periods in the past that you could have owned this stock here and here, all of them based on the ultimate Moade breakout. I am ericwithmoade.com. I leave you as I found you in the love light of the one infinite creator. Go forth rejoicing in the power and in the peace of the one creator. Adonai.